praised be Jesus. The wind is my sign. I will come in the wind. When the wind blows, know that I am with you. You have learned that the cross represents Christ. It is a sign of him. It is the same for the crucifix in your home. I am in the wind. Do not be afraid. Dear children, I wish to tell you these days to put the cross at the center of your life. Pray especially before the cross, which is the origin of great graces. In your homes, make a special consecration to the cross of the Lord. You will be able to receive divine love only in proportion to when you understand that on the cross, God offers you his immense love. I ask you not to permit my heart to cry with tears of blood because of the souls who are lost through sin. I beseech you, pray to Jesus. I am his mother, and I intercede for you with him. But all prayers go to Jesus. I will help. I will pray. But everything does not depend solely on me, but also on your strength and the strength of those who pray. I'm going to reveal a spiritual secret to you. If you want to be stronger than evil, make yourself a plan of personal prayer. Take a certain time in the morning, read a text from the Holy Scripture, anchor the divine word in your heart and strive to live it during the day, particularly during the moments of trials. In this way, you will be stronger than evil. My son's gift and mine at this moment is this. You will be comforted in your trials. They will be easier for you because we will be close to you. If you listen to us, we will show you how to overcome them. May the love of God be always in you because without it, you cannot be fully converted. Let the rosary in your hand make you think of Jesus. During these days, when you joyfully celebrate the Feast of the Cross, I wish that your own cross become a source of joy. Especially, dear children, pray in order to be able to accept sickness and suffering with love, as Jesus did. It is only in this way that I can experience the joy of giving you the graces and the cures which Jesus permits me to grant you. Renew your prayer before the cross. Dear children, I offer you special graces and Jesus, the extraordinary merits of the cross. Accept them and live them. Meditate on the passion of Jesus. Unite your life with Jesus. Pray and fast so that the kingdom of God may come among you. Let my son set you aglow with his fire. Raise your hands, yearn for Jesus, because in his resurrection, he wants to fill you with graces. Be enthusiastic about the resurrection. All of us in heaven are happy, but we seek the joy of your hearts. Goodbye, my angels. Go in the peace of God.